I think it was Christopher Lloyd who said that if a garden looks good in winter, it'll look good all through the year. The witch hazels, or hamamelis, are the first shrubs to come into bloom. Yellow, orange or red flowers with a wonderful fragrance appear like magic on naked stems, the flowers unrolling and twisting around like a small sparkler. The form and structure of deciduous trees and shrubs are massed all through the summer, but in winter it is their time to shine. The stunning stem colours of the cornus and salix setting your garden on fire. While trees such as Acer grisium, birches and some of the cherries look as though their silhouettes have burst into flames as the low winter sun shines through their peeling bark. Hellebores, an ashwood speciality, can withstand our unpredictable winter weather, but prefer a position sheltered from strong freezing winds. In times of hard frost, they will collapse down, only standing back up again when the temperature rises. I always said I would only collect about 10 different cultivars of snowdrops, which I could easily recognise at a distance. But beware, Galanthus are contagious. Snowdrops and aconites are perfect bedfellows, seeding around, carpeting the bare soil and brightening up even the coldest and greyest of winter days. I love winter in the garden. You seem to have that little bit more time to enjoy the structure of the trees and the magic of a long, cold winter's night. <laughs> <laughs>